Okay, this is the flight path of a C-130 Hercules that took off from Bryce Norton. It flew from Bryce Norton to Thetford Forest area. It's been flying around at 20, 25,000 feet, then it dropped to about 9,000 feet. Um, kept on going round and round. The different colours of this path are the different heights it was flying at. If you want to know what height it was at each time, you need to use the playback feature of Flight Radar 24, which is that button that looks kind of like a clock to the right of where it says bookmarks. You click on that, select the day. The day is 2nd of February 2015. And the time, well, it's now 6.10, so I would go back at least half an hour. Try and start it at about half five. And then find the plane that's flying over Thetford Forest. Click on that, and you can watch it actually make its flight path. And it's now heading back home. If I drag the map, you just click on the map and drag. And you can see the C-130 is now over Banbury. Yeah, it's it's following the more or less the same path as where it left from. So it'll be going back to Bryce Norton. So this is bound to be an RAF C-130 Hercules if it's coming out of Bryce Norton. That's a, just a picture, a standard issue picture. That's not the actual plane. Uh, Flight Radar 24 sometimes just uses a standard photo of the type of plane, as I found out earlier today, because they were mislabeling. Um, a plane that took off in Cambridge. Sometimes the photo has the registration of a plane on it, but the plane that I actually filmed had a different registration, so that's how I figured it out, you know. The photos are not necessarily the exact plane. Anyway, there you go. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.